Hello and welcome to the Lake District again. We're in Grysdale, a Grysdale campsite. Come and have a look at the pod we're in. So you come up a little path. There's the little dogs outside having a rest. This is the outdoor seating area. And a campfire, which we're looking forward to setting up later. And this is the little pod. See you again in a mo. been a nice afternoon had a little walk down past the farm um, and to a little pub called the Eagle's Head um, I like pubs <laughs> Chris likes pubs um, it was quite a nice little pub actually um, stop there for a swift one and then come back and now uh, we're sat outside our little pod uh, the Sun is just about to set behind the hill in front of me um, and we're just about to light a campfire so there you go there's the sun just about to set and it's cold <laughs> campfire there re all ready to go dogs are sat down here just enjoying the last bit of warmth of the sun and chris is over here hello just about to have his what what are you drinking oh look it's a beauty what's oh. this one Oh, northern monk. A northern monk. As you can only drink that when you're up north. Um, Toffee. Dogs barking. Toff, come here. Toff. And it's freezing. And it's a bit cold, so we're completely layered up. Um, I'm just going to sort the dogs. And there she goes. Beautiful campfire. And I do believe we have another pale ale on the go, do we, Chris? Uh, uh, what one have we got now? It's a brew dog. It's a brew dog. Mm. Still a northern. You prefer northern monk, I think. Oh, yeah, I'm easy. You You're know. not that fussy. I'm easy. Oh, I've fair got, enough. I've got a couple of, couple of layers on us. Oh, got, you have, yeah. I got this one. I got this one. <laughs> I got this one. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this one, <laughs> not that it's cold or anything. No, know. no, I, I, I'm not cold at all. Just a little. No, it's not too bad actually. But it will get cold. So, um, before I let myself get overly cold, I'm going to make sure I wrap up. Um, dogs are down. Um, down there. Just having a bit of a chill and a warm. In fact, I think maybe Toffee was a bit cold because he seems like he's enjoying it down there now. <coughs> so, yeah, the sun's now disappeared. Definitely feeling a bit cooler. There's a, quite a lot going on still. There's some yurts down the bottom. Um, and they most people have got campfires on the go and there's people cooking and it's quite nice actually all out in the woodlands there was a couple of blokes with a saw yeah you're quite right chopping the trees mm, there were and there's us yeah buying our wood yeah well we bought ours because it supports the farmer that actually owns the campsite so we we bought our wood from him 
and also it we're protecting the environment which is what you should do in my in my opinion rather than chopping down trees so i'm going to enjoy having a warm around the campfire and um might see you later bye see you tomorrow Morning glampers, Saturday morning, um, just had some breakfast, uh, dogs are down here waiting patiently to go, uh, beautiful blue sky this morning again, sun's out, oh Chris is trying to get a signal, so yeah, we're just gonna go up uh, one of the fells. Can't remember the name of it, but uh, it's only a smallish one. But we'll come back later. Hi. No. Oh, there's Pat. Hello. Hello. You're not feeling it today. how um, the sun is absolutely gorgeous um, over there you can make the sea out over there I'll see you can, you can see my yeah. Arm, not? yeah it's absolutely gorgeous to the point that it's that warm now we've just started to like take all our jackets off because it is absolutely gorgeous should be some good views when we get to the top uh, overlooking the full length of Windermere mm. so that's where we're heading up there See you in a bit. Well, we made it. We are at the top of House, um, House Fell. Something like that. Yeah. So, if I show you around. Try and give you quite a good 360 if I can. On this side, when we walk over in a minute, you can see. Yeah, I'm not very good at pointing all the places out, so. But that, the camera does not do it justice. Just make out right in the distance uh, Scarfell Pike, uh, Old Manor Coniston, that one there. Possibly going there tomorrow, aren't we, Michelle? <laughs> uh, this is Windermere, this is the, the southern end of Windermere, which goes on for a good 10 miles. You can't actually see the far side of it, which would be up up beyond that hill, up to Ambleside. Twigs and a bottle of water. Never tasted better, do you sure? I know. I've got a bottle of water as well. Tough. They've had their water.
as you can see it's really busy we were going to stop and have a little bit walk around but there's just too many people so um i think we're gonna give it a miss there's the lowwood hotel last time i was here was about 23 years ago looking beautiful as ever So we've come to Hawk's Head, a lot quieter here. Um, just managed to park the car. Should we have an ice cream, shall we? All, of a sudden. <laughs> all right. Yes, thanks. Boy, wait. Uh, we got off. <laughs> 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 the evening campers. I'm feeling a bit like the Michelin Man actually. It's been a really sunny day, but it's gone a bit cold again. So I'm layered up and um, got the fire going. Got the fire going. So. There's the fire. Uh, plenty of wood just to keep us going. Yeah, the farmer loves us. We keep buying more. Yeah, we do. Um, we've had, we've been to, no, we've walked up Gummer's Fell. No, Gummer's How Fell. I keep getting the name wrong. Gummer's How Fell, which was, good. Which was really nice. Um, yeah, the dogs are shattered. They're down there. That's them now. Look. Quite contented. Um, <clears throat> so we're just sitting in our little pod, um, having a, a beer or two. Um, would you like to tell us what what, what you're drinking over there? It's the original. It's the one that started it all. Another Northern Monk. You say it's a Northern Monk faith. The best beer in the world. Yeah. Um, well, so he says. <laughs> I till, prefer wine. Till the next one. Till the next one, yeah. Um, <clears throat> yes, that started off through watching Hayes Outdoors, who yeah. was a, who's a Northern Monk fan. So I bought one can on a camping trip, and um, that's it now. Is it's not a camping trip without a can of Northern Monk. <laughs> so where do so, we go today? So after, after we went up the fell, yeah, we then drove round to Bowness. Which was rammed. But it was, it was busy, very busy. Yeah. Um, so full, of, full of people, so we left that one. Yeah, yeah, it was just too much. So then we drove round to Ambleside. Um, couldn't park. No, that was a bit busy as well. Sometimes you just need to get away from people. And that was not the place to go if you want to get away from people. So <clears throat> then we went to... We came back to this side of Windermere, which we is did, quieter. which is quieter. What's that village called? Hawk's Head. Hawk's Head, that's it. So um, <clears throat> huge car park, no problems parking. There's still quite a few people, but nothing 
nowhere near like it was at Bowness and Ambleside. So I had a walk around there, stopped off and had a drink. And a meal in the pub. Yes, in the pub. Um, it was. was it I forget pub? what it was called. The cat. The cat they actually rescued cats, and, and they make a cat certain. Food. Yeah, no, they don't make cat food. Well, it was on the menu. <laughs> Okay, well they 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 do their own IPA, and it's called cat pissed. So yeah, you gave me a drink, said what you like. I said it's really nice. That. <laughs> and I went, oh, it's cat pissed. Yeah, point of cat. But that's what it was called. <clears throat> um, but apparently, a certain percentage of it goes towards uh, looking after the, the cats in the what do you call it um, rescue centre that they've got. So <clears throat> it's you have to drink for a good cause, really. Um, so yeah, that was <clears throat> nice round there. Um, then we came back here. Yeah. Dumped the car off. Mm -hmm. we went back to the local pub down the road. Yeah. What's that pub called? The Eagles Head. Eagles Head. That's yeah. quite a nice little pub as well, actually. That's quite nice. They're very friendly, and it's dog friendly as well, so that's good. Um, oh. Then we're back here. Fire yeah. lit, ready for a meal. Oh yes. So what are you going to have then? What are you having? Well, I thought I might have one of these, which is a veg, chilli and rice. Yeah, one of those. Um, nice. Uh, and yourself? Vegetables. Veg I need my vegetables. Um, well, <clears throat> I'm going for beef stew with potatoes. Cool. Okay, yeah. Nice. Just Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. Followed by chicken tikka and rice. Oh, okay. Oh, lovely. It's posh one. Comes in a bag. And so, so if you're having a pudding, I suppose. Mm. The, the date's 2024, so oh, it's got to be a good bit of chicken. Definitely. Uh, oh. For dessert. Oh. Oh. Sticky toffee pudding. Oh, lovely. Okay. Well, that should fill you up then. Followed by. Oh, there's more. Four ice buns. Ah. <laughs> <clears throat> you sure that'll be enough? Anything else? Yeah, some more beers. Some more beers. Yeah. So, um. Plans food... for tomorrow? Oh, yeah, plans for tomorrow. Uh, Coniston, we think. Um, nothing, just a bit of a walk around Coniston area. We're not going up Old Man Coniston, are we? I thought we were. You can. I'll wait. You you was a bit out of puff today. I think I'm a bit unfit. <laughs> it's been a while since I've done any hill walking. Walking, yes, but not hill walking. And it makes a difference. So but at least it wasn't wasn't too hot today. Um so yeah, we're just gonna sit and chill for the rest of the evening. Bye. Okay, see you later. That was it, cream, it's called. You come to get away from it all. You know, you're getting old when your wife starts reading beer cans and their descriptions. What, what's it say, sir? It says, brewed in the north with Brian Dixon. Described as an affable and vaguely eccentric brewing wizard in oversized wellies, is what it says. What's and then it? underneath it goes, I up, we're Northern Monk. <laughs> What's the brew dog one say? I don't know. Why? Well, there's a lot of Chinese writing on it. Can you read that? No. Just have a go. I can't. I, I, no, because I might say something. <laughs> I might say something that's swearing in Chinese and I wouldn't know. You just have a go. I can't. They're not letters. No, I'll go back to Northern Monk. I can understand that Northern Monk. Northern Monk. Northern Monk. New beer. It's not a new beer, I've had it before, but it's an unusual one because it's Brewdog 
versus Northern Monk. Mm, interesting. So that's two companies with two lots of beer in one can. Interesting. What's it going to taste like then? It smells good. Nice amber colour. Beautiful. I'm still confused how you can have two companies in one can. Wow. But anyway, you know. They've decided to get together, haven't they? Always best to test it. Oh, you've got to. You've got to try these things. Verdict. Honest verdict. Nearly as nice. Nearly as nice. Right. As a vanilla milkshake for a McDonald's. Morning glampers. So this morning we're in Coniston. Um, just behind me, up there in the clouds, is Old Man Coniston. Um, not planning on going up there today, but um, we're just having a little walk around the village, which actually it looks really nice this morning. Um, it's warming up nicely. There you go. Morning. Morning. Dogs are here. Coniston water. Ready, Fudge? Good boy, Fudge. Good boy. Let's stick. Good boy, Toffee. Good boy. Come on, Fudge. Come on, Toff. You gonna get it? Oh, right, Pete. Good boy, Fudge. Great view of Coniston Old Man over there. To a place called Bardsea. Um, just going to give the dogs a bit of a run on the beach. Um, never been here before. It's up. It's lovely. It's really quite quiet. Um, where are they? Oh, there they are. Having a bit of the zoomies. <laughs> so anyway, we're just having a bit of a walk around here, burn a bit of energy off for them before uh, before we go back. Um, not sure how much I'll be able to film now because actually we've not bought the charger so we'll probably run out of battery. So I'm going to say bye for now. Bye. Hey, tough. Come on, tough. <laughs> 